Hey, hi friends. Welcome to my channel. So friend, today's session is going to be a bit interesting for you. The reason behind that, there have been questions coming from the viewers that what is the average salary of a Linux system administrator who is a fresher, right? Or a two years of experience or a, a four plus years of experience, five plus years of experience or a six plus years of experience, right? So you can see those comments also here also recently, uh, I think just 16 hours ago, that somebody is telling that I am a Linux system admin having four uh, years of experience, uh, AWS solution uh, associate, right? Uh, one year of experience. So how much CTC should I demand as per IT market and which path best for me to get the best salary package, right? Similar way, how much salary except uh, as a fresher in Linux system administration profile and uh, there is uh, a question right uh, another question is there that uh, what is the salary that we can expect for a five years of experience as a linux system admin friend right uh, so even though i have mentioned that the salary uh, range for a linux system admin can vary on multiple factors right those factors are uh, basically i would say your location uh, is one of the factor another factor is it's going to be your uh, the reason behind that one because it could be your tier one tier two tier three cities right and uh, the second factor is going to be your skills and all if you are only coming with a linux administration right and uh, there is no additional skills on top of it like like shell scripting is there you know any kind of uh, automation you know any kind of a scripting language like uh, shell scripting or a python right or you know uh, about cloud and all so it's totally depends upon your skill and at the same time how was your interview went well or not right so how you have performed well in your interview that also a factor right and uh, then finally the previous salary also matters friend right uh, like suppose uh, how much salary you are getting as a fresher right so today i am going to reveal that how much salary you are going to get as a linux system administrator for two plus years of experience my friend right at the same time uh, i am going to show you what google if you search in google right what the average salary of a Linux system administrator who is having two plus years of experience is going to get. And I am going to compare that data with my own authentic data. This is not some kind of a dummy data, my friend. So I always talk on the basis of authentic data, right? All of you know, right? And in front of you, I am going to present my own salary slip when I was working as a Linux system administrator and partially as a VMware administrator in HP, my friend, right? So first of all, let's go and see in Google, if you type in Google, like uh, suppose, what is the average salary of a Linux system administrator in India, who is having two plus years of experience, my friend. So you can see clearly in this website, you can visit, there are multiple websites, my friend, that is going to show you that what is the Linux system administrator, right? Uh, average salary. And even you can see here, the salaries, it, it came, this data is coming for almost 13.1K uh, salaries. I'm not sure how much authentic data this is, but this is all about, right? And it's telling as a Linux system administrator who is having two plus years of experience in India, he should get almost five lakhs, right? According. And uh, if you scroll down a little bit here, so what, what is the salary? Uh, salaries in different departments, it's not only restricted to Linux system administrator, I would say. It will be from IT and information security, right? Or a software engineer or a QA or something like that, right? So you can see it's almost range somewhere around like five lakhs and something. If you are having almost two plus years of experience and here also the chart by looking at this chart, you can see, understand that almost if you are having almost one to two years of experience, you should get almost three lakhs. And if you are having two to three years of experience, you should get somewhere around like four lakhs, right? And if you are having three to four years of experience, you should get somewhere around like 4.52 right so according to that only if you see here even though i have commented that if you are having almost five plus years of experience you should get the salary between five lakhs to ten lakhs but what is the actual data is saying right so all of you know that uh i started my journey 
as an application support engineer, my friend, right? And then I have moved as a Linux system administrator, right? And I have extensively worked as a Linux system administrator for almost around five years, right? During that period, I have started learning different tools and technology, like that is, I would say like VMware administrator, right? And I started learning the cloud as well. And then I have moved from there, right? As a cloud engineer, right? And then finally from there, I have moved as a DevOps engineer. And then finally from there as a senior DevOps engineer and as a lead DevOps engineer. And currently I'm managing a team of almost 14 DevOps engineer under me, right? So you can see the extensive or the expertise I have. Uh, it's not only, I would say simply I'm saying something to you. No, it's on the basis of the data. So I have analyzed, I have seen this industry from almost, I would say my current experience is coming somewhere around 13 years, right? So I have seen this industry, right? Almost 15 years on the basis of that, I have analyzed everything and I am showing it to you guys. Okay. So now let me show you being a Linux system administrator, almost two plus years of experience, how much you are going to get my friend. So this is the data in front of you, my friend. So you can see the salary confirmation statement uh, due to some confidential issues. I cannot show you the company logo and all, uh, but I was working in HPE earlier. It was HP and then it was split up into HPE and HP Inc. Okay. So I was part of HPE, soft Hewlett Packard Software Enterprise, the software division, my friend. And there you can see clearly, uh, right, uh, I was, my designation is basically ITO service delivery and it's mainly the job role is mainly related to Linux administrator and a VMware administrator, my friend, right? So I was extensively working as a Linux system administrator and a VMware administrator. And then finally, you can see the current salary. I was when I joined HP, right? And uh, that time I was getting somewhere around like, uh, five lakhs and then and in the middle of the year you'll get some appraisals and also those appraisals i got it over here so you can see the my salary got incremented to five lakhs fifty thousand so this was the uh, you can see what i was getting as a basic salary 40 percent flexible benefit plan and all right and then finally what i was getting uh the new one which is after a fifty thousand increment and all my friend so this salary, I am telling you almost when I am having almost two plus years of experience into this IT industry, my friend, right? So you can understand the data, the data which we are seeing here is somewhere around almost correct only. So if you are going for a Linux system administrator job as a two plus years of experience, so you are going to get somewhere around like five lakhs as a average salary i'm talking about again it's going to vary also on the basis of your skill set suppose you have additional skill sets with you you have knowledge of cloud you have knowledge of some devops tools you have knowledge of your vmware platform as well right it's totally depends upon you and how was the your interview uh gone right and uh, what was your previous salary also it, it there are multiple factors on that one so so friends, I hope you have liked the today's session and now you have understand what is the average salary of a two plus years of experience of a Linux system administrator, my friend, right? And if you wanted to know what is the average salary of a four plus years of experience of a Linux system administrator, then do more and more comment on this video, then I'll come up with that as well. And then like my journey, same thing I'm going to show you and right when my experience was almost five plus years of experience and then I started working as a cloud mainly into cloud and I, at the same time I started learning as a DevOps tools and all right. So what was the salary at that time? What is the salary when I am having almost six plus years of experience or eight plus years of experience? And now if you wanted to know my current salary also where I'm managing a DevOps team completely, right? So everything I'm going to reveal in front of you, but it's only you who can support me, my friend, by watching this video and sharing with almost everyone, right? And please do more and more comments. So I'll come up with similar kind of video, right? So it's going to help you to understand the authenticity. I believe totally in the 
authentic data it's not some kind of a dummy data like others do right they will simply put a very fancy thumbnail and all but no i don't do it like that i will reveal everything in front of you because i have been working in this it industry for almost 13 years right it's somewhere around like 13 years so person who is having almost 13 years those guys only can tell you the complete in-depth knowledge of this IT industry, my friend, right? So I hope you have liked the today's session. If you have liked the today's session, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for all the latest notification, my friend. Till then, just do take care of your loved one and yourself. Bye-bye and Jai Hind, my friend.